Today we're just going to talk a little bit about purge welding, why we do it and what it does. The main reason of purge welding is to remove oxygen and moisture which gets rid of contaminants from your weld. It also helps with discoloration, um, undercutting and things like that. Pretty much when you purge you're filling a vessel, a tube, a bit of pipe or something with inert gas which we use as argon so we've got a couple of caps on this pipe here so if we're going to purge weld this up we'll hook up to our regulator, put our purge on one of the lower parts of the pipe because argon's heavier and then we'll fill it up. Better purge out here, we'll block off this one. There are a couple of other ways to purge. You can use a um, purge wand if you're back purging large sheets of steel. So if someone's welding on this side of a sheet, you can have the purge wand on the other side and that'll just stop it from cauliflowering out and, and keep it all, all nice and consistent. There's also a purge monitor here. This is how you can measure what the oxygen levels are in your weld. So you can turn this on, put it in on your exit point and wait till you get down to the, the correct oxygen levels in the pipe and then you know it's good to weld. That's for more critical, probably more food grade than what we're doing here. It's a good broad coverage of, of why we purge weld. Makes the weld stronger, cleaner, less prone to corrode and rust as well. Like us, follow us and check out what we're up to next week. There'll be some cool stuff happening in the fab bay and until then, catch you guys later.